all, welcome back to another Odoo 18 tutorial by Cybrosis. Are you guys tired of repetitive customer queries? Odoo 18's canned responses and chatbots are here to the rescue. In this video, we'll explore how these powerful tools can automate your customer interactions, improve response times and enhance customer satisfaction. So without wasting any time, let's begin. First of all, let's see how to configure canned responses as well as the chatbots. For that, you have to go to the live chat module. So this is the live chat. Once you open it, you have this configuration menu. Go to the configuration under which you have both canned responses and chatbots. So let's open canned responses. So canned response is really simple. You can actually create a shortcut for a sentence or a group of words. Okay, so here you can see a shortcut which is created that's hi. Similarly, I'm going to create a new shortcut. So I am giving hello. Okay, so this is the shortcut and the sentence I'm giving here is hello, welcome to Odoo. So this is the message which I'm giving. So the shortcut for this particular sentence is hello. Okay. So just by using this hello, they should be able to use this particular sentence. So I'm not confusing you. Uh, I'll simply show you. So after this, I'm just refreshing the page. Okay. And then let's go back. Okay. Let's go to the discuss module. Okay. So here's the discuss module. And simply go back. Here you have the discuss. And I'm going to choose a DM. So let it be this one. Okay. And here, if you click on the, you know, messaging area and just put a colon. So here, once you use in this colon, what happens is that the shortcuts will come. Okay. So you can see the shortcuts as well as the sentence. So I'm just choosing the one which I created right now. So without typing, what you can do just by using the shortcuts, you can actually, you know, do it. Other than that, what do you have to, you have to type the message and send it okay instead of that you can use the colon and from there you can choose whatever canned response you are you know it's suitable for you okay so if you want to choose this one you can choose this okay so this is how you can use the canned responses now this canned responses can be used in the chat as well okay so here also you can any i mean same thing which you find in the discuss module is what here also we can access right so from here also, you can use the canned responses. So that's the canned response. Next, let's go back to the live chat again. So this is the live chat. Now under configuration, you have the chat boards, right? So these are the pre-created chat boards. If you want to create a new one, click on new. You have to specify a name for your chat board. And this is the scripting area, okay? So you can set the messages that should be feeded to the chat board here. You can set the type the answers and conditions. So I'll simply show you the one which is pre-created. So here you have a welcome boat. Okay, so the name of the boat is welcome boat. And you can see the script which is given. That is you have messages, the step type, answers and some conditions. So the first message here is welcome to company name. So the company name in the sense, the company's name will be shown there. The type is given as text and no answers are specified. And there is another thing which is what are you looking for? So you'll be having these much answers out of which you can select one. Okay. And so you can see different questions have been set here. The step type is set here. Answers are set here. And also the conditions have been set here. So this is how the setting up of this is done. There are only two steps are there, right? To name the chatbot as well as set the script for it. Okay, so here you have this test button. If you click on test, you can actually test your boat. So this is the website and inside the website, you can simply see this. Okay, so welcome to company name. What are you looking for? So as I've shown you, there are three options which is given. So I'll just put, I'm just looking around. Okay, that's what I'm putting. And you can see the answers have come. So this is how you basically configured the chat boat as well as the canned response and use it. Okay, so it's that simple. I hope you guys now know how to use both. So that's all for today's video. Thank you so much for watching and see you guys in the next video.